Hi everyone, my name's Anne Marie and welcome to this episode of Cup TV brought to you by www.craftshoeprint.com. In this episode, we're going to be looking at a gorgeous mini kit from Mary McBean. The cup number for this kit is Cup 972462 underscore 1648. The kit is called Live, Breathe, Sew Card Mini Kit. You get three sheets in the kit and they're all beautiful. The first sheet that you get is the insert sheet with some extra images that you could use for decoupage or for making tags etc for the card. The second sheet is the decoupage layer for the front of the card again with the extra toppers for the decoupage sheet. And then the third sheet is the main image for your card base which will fit on a 7.5 to an 8 inch card. Then you've got extra sentiments as well. So we're going to make the card and I want to give you an idea for one of the images that you can use. So our base card that I'm using is an 8x8 card. It's just a standard white blank card. And the first thing I'm going to do is on the back of the card I've taken one of the images that can either be used as an extra or for decoupage and I've got flat tape on the back of it so I'm simply going to peel the tape away this is normal standard tape that you can get from Craft Shield Print and I'm just going to place the image on the back of the card in the centre I've also taken one of the blank sentiments and I've added my name so that the recipient of this card will know that I've made it for them and I'm just adding the label across the top of the little image and that's the back of the card. Looks really professional and it'll match the rest of the card perfectly. So next we're going to create the insert. And Mary's made a gorgeous insert that matches the card so perfectly. I've got it on just flat tape on the back. And all I'm going to do is remove the back of the tape and place this inside the card. All these sheets were printed on the print and post service from Craft Shield Print and the print is gorgeous and the finish is gorgeous and they look perfect on your cards. So I can press that down and that's the insert. Now we can turn our attention to the front of the card. So Mary's included the base image and what you can do is you can either use the base image as it is with the words live, breathe, so, and then build up the decoupage or you can actually add the next layer which is what we're going to do and we can add our own sentiments. So you can use this in a couple of ways. So I'm peeling off the flat tape for the base image and I'm simply going to position it on top of my card and then press it down. There we go. So our next layer is the first layer of decoupage and you can see how I'm going to cover over those words so you can either leave them as they are and then build up the decoupage or you can use the next layer. So I've got mine on 3D foam and I'm simply, for any new crafters, decoupage is just building up the elements over the previous pattern and building it into layers. So I'm just popping the layer over the previous one and press it down and then I've got a couple of images to add over the top again these are on 3D foam and just place the image over the top and then the next one again over the top and you see how there was the image for the back you could go on and create another layer to build up the height obviously we've used one of the images for the back and then I'm taking two sentiments that I've cut out that Mary's included these are just on 3D foam and I'm simply adding them just to the side and that finishes off our card perfectly 
and you can see how the front matches the insert and then the back makes it so professional and what a gorgeous card. Now you can see any of Mary's designs by going to Mary McBean on the www.craftsuprint website and I want to give you a reminder of the cup number for this and it was cup 972 462 underscore 1648 so please check out Mary's designs on Craft Show Print and I'd just like to say thank you so much for watching and we shall see you next time.